Hello, this is Fisher Fan and here we are with another speed build. And this is uh, another build for the filming of a Luna Island challenge, which we're getting close to. I had this idea in my head that I wanted to make um, something that looked like a vacation home. So that's what we did. It's a fully socked out house it's uh, got a kitchen bathroom but it kind of has this uh, uh, vacation vibe like a, a house like um, <coughs> in uh, on the Fiji Islands something like that So I kind of had this idea in my head and that's what we're trying to make, it's, uh, it's difficult because it's The Sims, it's not real life and that sometimes makes life difficult, so that's what we're trying to trying to recreate here. It's giving me a harder time than I thought it would, but I think for now I'm getting the vibe that I will want to go for. It took some time. That's usually the case. But still, I finished this build in over an hour, so that's still quite fast. It's, it's, it's a very small build, of course, except for getting the shape down. That that's always takes a little bit of time. But and the rest is quite easy and I think this build really suits this island especially this lot as this lot uh, looks uh, out this like the edge of the world lot thingy and I think in the end I like the result so that that's always good And now I'm trying to make a bed. Usually, at least the photos that I've seen, you always have white bed sheets. So that's what we're going for. But I'm giving the white bed sheet sheets just a tiny, just a tiny touch extra. Because completely white sheets on beds is not really a thing that I like. And then let's see, do I have anything else really to tell? I need to tell. Nope, not really, I think. My life it just isn't very interesting. It's never been, will never be. I want this house to have a little bit more storage space than the other ha than than here with. But I think we're moving in that closet that we just recovered outside to the hallway, so that there is a little bit more uh, room. Uh, in the past I've built a couple of tiny houses and it's, that's good because then you know how much room something really needs. Uh, 
and I really like this idea of this uh, bathtub in the cabin. So that's what we're doing. Trying to make sure that we're giving this house all the contents, tiles and stuff. This island kind of has a lot of modern houses with modern furnishings. It's very on trend. Um, um, interiors and stuff. Uh, that's just because that's my style. Uh, and uh, just be glad I don't only build one type of house. <laughs> I like the fact that I could switch my style up if I needed to. But yeah, most of it, most of the style, my style is always the same, right? That's just something it is, that's something I can't change or something, yep. That's just the way it is. But as I said, this is quite a small build, so I am almost done. I think that was the bedroom. We're moving on to, uh, we're doing stairs, that's always useful for them to get into the house. And we're doing this, this very tiny, tiny kitchen. As uh, it would be sad if a family got uh, put in this house. <coughs> and then they didn't have a place to make, uh, make stuff and stuff. Not make it would be handy to have a kitchen there because this lot might not now not be filled, but I am planning on finding out how you uh, start in to play in this world. So that's what we're currently looking. Also, uh, I'm not looking into it right now, but that's something that I want in the future. Because Aluna Island is quite bare and I would like to start building in it. Uh, I would like to start playing in a fuller, more full world. So that's what I'm trying to accomplish with filling up Aluna. And just yeah, well, the just putting some finishing touches here and there, which is always useful. And then we do this tiny this tiny bathroom in a sec, I think, and then a little bit of the outside, and then it's uh, done. I think I think I already mentioned this, but. This is not quite what I had envisioned in my head to uh, for this to look. So that's uh, it's okay, but I would would have liked it to look different than what it's looking at like right now. Well, as I said, the, the Sims is kind of limited sometimes and. That's why we ended up with something like this, instead of something else. But it's it's kind of okay-ish, it looks uh, quite nice. I could spend a vacation here, I think. It's a private pool and a nice view of the ocean and nothing else. Now it's a difficult part of trying to roof this because it's just not, it's not roofable, it's just not. But 
this is gonna take the rest of the video just to say I had this thing in my head what I wanted to do with this roof and it's just it's not it's not working. I wanted the the, the sticky out bit to uh, the, that that roof to be aligned with the rest of the roof and that just was not working not the way I wanted it so that's uh, currently what I'm trying to do in case you're wondering what is she doing that's what I'm trying to do and now we're putting down a little bit of baluster around it just to make it look safe and nice because that's always handy to have a safe house not something that you could just trip and fall off and then break your foot and stuff because that would not be handy and I really wanted to put in that uh, shower so that's what we did which kind of makes this bathroom kind of useless except for the toilet maybe as we have the shower outside but we check in a shower here as well and some mirrors and a sink and of course the toilet because that's always useful and I think uh, yeah this is kind of the end result here just a little bit little bit some little bits and bobs like right here on top <sighs> trying very hard to record this for so my voice is saying, Lisa, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Don't try to talk on your own. Doesn't make sense. That's what my voice is saying. And I, I think we do a little bit on the outside, or maybe not. Oh, we of course I forgot we needed wallpaper. I didn't have any wallpaper. So yeah, that's what we're doing right now, and it's looking quite okay. I quite like it. And I think some lights maybe, more wallpaper. And we finish up this kitchen a tiny bit more. I like this plant. This is this, this hanging loose plant. But I think that's the end of, at least for me, for this video. I'm gonna say goodbye. This was Friesenfan. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did like my video, subscribe to my channel so you will see the next video next Tuesday. And I hope you have a nice day. Bye.